there today, it's going to be much more comfortable. Temperatures only in the 80s for today by the end of the daytime hours. About 88 degrees for our daytime high up in Paso Robles. Really comfortable conditions for all of those events happening this morning. Still a little bit on the more mild side, but continuing to see really extreme heat building in later on this week. So enjoy these more mild conditions while you can. It's going to be seeing significantly warmer conditions over the next few days. Now, one thing that we are also seeing across the rest of the Central Coast is lots more of that marine influence. Yesterday, it's really dense, low-lying layer. You could see that out in this photo out in Morro Bay, or what you can see in Morro Bay in this photo is just the very tops of those three stacks in Morro Bay, and you can really see just the depth of that marine layer from this, especially with that clear sky starting to build in after that. Beautiful conditions taken in this photo by Nathaniel Redman. If you have any photos like this one that you're particularly proud of, we'd love to see them. Make sure to send them to us using the hashtag be on KSBY, and we'd love to feature them right here on KSBY News Daybreak. Now, now, one thing that we're looking at today is that fog. It is continuing to stick around along all of our western beaches, mainly more as some low-lying cloud cover there, but really feeling more like fog closer to the surface, especially in many of our coastal valleys and along our south coast. We even do have a little bit building into the Paso Robles area along the Salinas River Valley at this point. Really no major concerns with visibilities for this, but it is keeping us a little bit cooler, leaving that more dense, cooler air in place through the daytime hours. And we also have some more on onshore flow that's going to keep it a little bit cooler. Now the one major component of our forecast that has been there over the last few days is our big monsoon circulation. So there's a low pressure system sitting just about here, a high pressure system sitting in the Rockies, and that's bringing this big arc of clouds, and they're unfortunately missing us entirely. We could be seeing that move just a little bit farther towards us here with that low pressure system drifting just a little bit farther towards the west and that is going to break down our pattern over the next few days but until it does we've got good conditions so we've got that strong northerly wind that's going to start building in a little bit later on today shifting a little bit farther on shore that's where we're going to be seeing gusts up to about 27 miles an hour this afternoon in Paso Robles so if you're out of the mid-state fair could get a little bit gusty but it's going to be keeping us a little bit cooler especially in those interior valleys with that strong onshore wind continuing in the afternoon afternoon hours then calming down as we head into the overnight hours as well. So here are your temperatures for today. 88 degrees in Paso Robles, 75 in San Luis Obispo, 71 in Santa Maria, 69 degrees in Lompoc and 70 degrees in Santa Barbara for today along our north coast, 59 degrees in Cayucas, 83 in Atascadero, 69 degrees in Avila Beach in the five cities region, slightly more comfortable along those beaches, 66 in Guadalupe, 71 in Napomo, 91 degrees in Shandon and along our south coast. More of those very similar conditions there as well. 71 degrees in Goleta, 96 degrees in the Cuyama Valley, and 85 degrees in San Inez. Over the next seven days, we're going to be seeing more of the same across the majority of our central coast, staying right around normal along our, all our coastal valleys and our beaches, but warming back up into the triple digits by Thursday. We've got a big warm up, then it's going to be staying near normal for this time of the year for the rest of the forecast and for the rest of the Mid-State Fair. Aaron, back to you.